Boys and welcome back to Warner Farms. So yesterday we actually started picking corn. However, with my sinus headache, which I'm now calling it as now, it actually is going away today, thankfully. Uh, I did not get much filming done. I was actually out part of the day yesterday, but in the afternoon we did start picking corn. So Barry and I are going to take these last two loads in that are drying up into the elevator this morning. We're going to come back, we're going to finish picking these last few loads out that need to be dried back to the farm. Dad's working on getting the bin opened up, that north bin. Not sure what we're going to do the rest of the day after we get this done. Potentially we may try cutting beans if it's dry enough. I doubt it will be and so does Dad. But otherwise, we're going to be picking corn this morning. I can't remember if this is an 800 or 850,000 bushel GSI bin going up. I believe it's GSI. But they've got the foundation done, and I believe they will be starting on the bin shortly here as far as uh, jacking the bin here. So that'll be pretty cool to see. Hopefully they're doing that, which they should be while we're hauling up here. Not now, uh, but I would assume in the coming weeks here soon. So dad called and he said that he's got to run to Hotch Chat while he's over in Napanee because there's a bearing out on a shaft on the dryer. So he's got to get that fixed before that is ready to rock and roll. So since what's left in this field over here is too wet to haul into the elevator, we're going to take this back to the farm and dry it. So I'm going to work on getting this first semi picked and when Barry gets back I'll get that other semi picked full and we'll take these back to the farm finish wrapping things up over there, come back, finish this field, and maybe, just maybe, we'll try and cut beans today. The grain cart is at the shed, and the 8530 is on the vertical till right now, and actually, later today, more than likely, uh, I'll finish vertical tilling over on Marx's.
sun needs to come out. It's real overcast today. enough or not? Yeah, it's plenty loose. I just gotta get a good handle on it. Takes like three hands. <laughs> that one ain't bad. The one on that one, there's no clampering, so you gotta put two bolts and nuts on it. Oh, that's keys. That one's my job. Uh, it'll be keys though. I, uh, <laughs> I know the right technique to how to do it. Well, then Tell you best, best be teaching, teaching in the right yeah, technique shoot. so when you don't go up there, we've Tell had this conversation the, about... Tell me when there's still some play in it. Just a little bit more. Oh, that's good. That's plenty. At least it doesn't wobble though. running up into that leg, up into that bend. There's an auger right there that you can see there that runs across to the dryer. Dad and Barry are back there. They're loading up the dryer, getting ready to fire that up, and we'll get that set. And all this corn is dumped into that north bend, which really there's only going to be about three, four loads that are going to go in off of this field. Then we're not sure what we're going to do. Sun's come out, so that's just the beam. The wind will just pick up just a little bit more. That'd be nice.
dryer going. I'm gonna go back over to Black Semi and finish picking that corn out. Once they get that dryer set, they're gonna come back over and head over to the river and check the beans over there and see if we can finish cutting those beans over there today. for this field. Well, we've got rain on the way. You can see it off to the west over there, how dark blue it is. It's clouding up. So, with that, we are not gonna be able to cut beans today. That sucks. I was kinda hoping we could get that done. Though there is some vertical tilling I could be doing over on Marx's. There's about, I think Dad said he left about 20, 25 acres over there that still needs to be done. So depending on when it looks like it's gonna rain, which my phone shows not till this evening, probably sometime around four o'clock. And it's almost two o'clock right now, it looks like. Um, I could potentially go over there and get that knocked out while Dad's messing with the dryer and getting the dryer dialed in for these four loads going in that bin. So I guess for the rest of the day, we'll just play it by ear and see uh, what we're going to be doing. to go finish vertical tilling. We're not entirely sure when it's going to rain. The radar is not really giving us a good indication of when, but it looks like somewhere between the next hour to two hours it will be raining. Dad's having some issues with the dryer, pretty much exactly like what we were having last year when we first started running the dryer. It seems to be kicking out after about five minutes of running, so I'm not entirely sure what the issue is. He's not really sure what the issue is, so hopefully he can play with it here some more and get it figured out why it keeps wanting to do that. Well, it's starting to spit. Good thing I just got the end rows to do and then I'm done. That's a wrap. Alright guys, that's going to do it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Snapchat. And I will catch you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.